I think this is something that the Prime Minister has to deal with. Um, it's not only uh, the minister responsible for the status of women, but uh, about a third of his cabinet voted for that motion. Uh, given the comments that he made publicly about the motion, um, I think it really is a question now of his own credibility and what his word is about. Um, so I think it's a question that he has to address um, in terms of uh, how his ministers voted, in particular uh, Rona Ambrose, because she is the minister responsible for the status of women. This is the first question that I've received on the status of women file this year. In fact, I think that this is the first question I've received since last year as well. And you know why that is, Mr. Speaker? It's because this government has an incredible track record of standing up for Canadian women. <laughs> And so far, in just a couple of years, we've funded over 550 projects from coast to coast to coast to tackle violence against women and empower women and girls. And we'll continue to do just that.